usual line of succession in North Korea is very like any old monarchy. The first founding leader, Kim Il-sung, who ruled for a very long time, he was put in by the Russians in 1945, but he became more independent of them. He started this thing of power being in the family. It is very patriarchal. You have the cultural inheritance of Confucianism. Obviously, it's officially repudiated, but this is, you know, for, for centuries, the particular hierarchy is based upon age and also on gender. There are still very few women uh, as ministers in senior positions of any kind. So Kim Yo-jong, if, if she were to have a chance to succeed, I think she would face a lot of obstacles. Nobody who is not of royal blood, unless there is some kind of revolution, could formally take power. But behind the scenes, in terms of what factions, what opinions, again, we don't know for sure, but almost everyone would need a Kim as a figurehead. Mm -hmm.